So guys, uh, you can hear that uh, there's popping uh, on it. It means that's the first crack. Um, usually, we already um, starting to reduce the temperature on that time because uh, first crack it means the carbonyl uh, carbonyl effect. It means uh, it's a chemical reaction uh, of the nutrients inside the coffee beans itself that uh, creates uh, it. The, the beans is getting bigger, so uh, that's the effect of it. It's called it's called uh, carbonyl carbonyl effect. So I think uh, I'm going to stop roasting it already because some of it is already getting darker. It's getting uh, maybe it will going to have it already first uh, second crack, so it will be dark roast already, and I don't want that one. The traditional way how Filipinos uh, roast their coffee is, is they're going to uh, roast it until it have it has oil already. So uh, specialty way, um, they already stop roasting it uh, when it's already uh, medium roast already. Or on the first crack, sometimes they they just uh, wait for at least a minute. Then they're going to uh, turn off already the um, fire or temperature. They're going to drop it already. So uh, I think I'm going to stop now. It. I'm going to put it in here just to cool it down and to remove some of its uh, so maybe some are wondering guys uh, why there's a super light beans that it's not for example this uh, it, it did not get darker uh, because some of it uh, we are calling it Quakers Quakers doesn't have enough nutrients inside and doesn't have uh, proper moisture to have its uh, like there's no totally taste on this one I think this is tastes only like nuts so I'm going to remove that so first uh, I'm going to sort it first before I uh, try to cut it so I'm just going to pick uh, the beans that I think it's better <laughs> Uh, at least we need a uh, 13 grams or 12 grams so guys uh, I already sort some of the beans uh, you know guys uh, what is the problem on this it's not equally roasted so that's a uh, that's a problem because the taste will not be uh, consistent. Some some uh, some of the taste some uh, will be kind of uh, burned or something like that. So much better to sort it out, remove some of uh, Quakers and uh, totally burned beans. So okay, let's try to cup.
actually the smell it's not that bad. I can smell some some uh, black plum. Yeah, something sweet. Let's try it. So I use uh, 92 degrees Celsius and we're going to wait until uh, 4 minutes until I started to break the crust and smell the aroma and I'm going to evaluate it uh, if it's good or not good. <laughs> For my opinion, there's no enough flavors on it, but it's kind of sweet. Um, for me, I taste wild berry. Uh, for the sweetness, it's actually long sweet. Um, it's actually better than I expected. <laughs> I expect worse. Uh, I don't know if I tried it on uh, um, some other brewing materials like uh, V60 or Aeropress or uh, French press but it's actually not that super bad it's not really that good like the one you uh, roast in uh, actual uh, roasting machine but It's actually not bad. Maybe I, I will going to finish this and I'm going to give some of my flatmates and so that it will not be waste. Uh, you know me, I don't want to waste beans so I'm going to drink it all and I'm going to share it to some of my flatmates. So that's it guys. Uh, hopefully uh, you learned something for today and uh, for the people who are not yet subscribed on my channel uh, click subscribe and always click the notification bell so that you're always updated on my videos especially on my coffee vlogs uh, actually i'm planning to uh, remain only all of my uh, coffee vlogs and i'm going to transfer some of my live vlog on uh, my uh, other channel uh, hopefully um, 
I think it's much more better. So that's it guys. Uh, I hope you learned something for today. And thank you very much for watching. And see you again. God bless. Always uh, be caffeinated. Keep safe. Stay at home. And hopefully you're stay well. Thank you very much. And see you guys. Bye.